Hi guys, thank you very much for joining me here today. I wanted to shoot this quick video basically on the new YouTube rules and regulations. Um, you might have noticed if you have a channel with less than 10,000 views that you're no longer getting any ads. This is because YouTube have decided to make sure that they're going to put ads on channels that have over 10,000 views. What does this mean to you? Well basically what's happened is the advertisers, a lot of them have pulled out um, from YouTube and they've done this. People like Revlon and several different brand names. They've done this because they no longer want to be associated with some of the YouTube channels out there that are producing content that doesn't comply with the advertisers of the YouTube ad space. Um, basically, you know, sort of like if you've got a channel out there that um, has a lot of swearing or something like that. The advertisers don't want to be associated with that. Um, so a lot of them have pulled out. So YouTube have made sure that all the channels have to have 10,000 views before they're even going to put ads on those uh, particular channels. This is to make sure that um, the content that is being produced is good, clean, quality content. So what does it mean to us? Well, basically we've got to make sure that we're producing videos that are good, good quality content um, to get the views, because views means money. Other things to bear in mind when you're doing your videos to make sure you have a great title, a nice catchy title that people are going to click on. If it's a boring title, people just won't click on it. And also your thumbnail, your thumbnail has to be really catchy and punchy. I mean basically if you're going to eat food and you go to a cafeteria or a restaurant or something and they've got pictures up of the food, you're just going to go, yeah I want that. Because basically that's your lead in um, to get people to want what they want. Um, so you're going to have a really, really good thumbnail. Also um, videos over 5 minutes, up to about 10 minutes, normally rank better than um, videos only one or two minutes long so it's good to have a long If you video. are starting up a new channel and you're thinking of 10,000 views on my days it's going to take ages to get to um, basically you need to give yourself a window between one and six months to make any revenue on YouTube so as long as you follow the procedures put good quality content on that and put stuff on there that you're passionate about anyway on that note let's have a look over on the trusty computer have a look at how this is affecting us at the moment with the different icons. Okay, so we're on the YouTube help page and basically it's uh, on the 7th of August they came out with this new notification uh, and it is for appeal videos marked not suitable for all advertisers. So they're really clamping down now on all videos that don't meet the advertisers requirements um, well, what do I mean by that? Well, basically, YouTube and the advertising market want to make sure they've got good, clean videos out there. They're making sure that the advertisers are on the right YouTube videos. The advertisers don't want to be on any videos that promote hate speech, racism, um, terrorist activities or anything like that because they're a brand. And it's obvious that they wouldn't want to be endorsing any videos that are deemed unsuitable um, for their brand image. So YouTube have had to become compliant with the advertisers for those particular reasons. So they brought this out on the 7th of August. They began updating the monetization icons in the video manager to better identify videos um, that have limited or no ads on them. Um, what that means to us is if you have green icon against all of your videos, yay, you are good to go. Um, if you have any strike throughs, uh, this generally means you've uh, abused the copyright issues or you've got a video out there that is, um, yeah, has swearing on it. And if you have three strikes, as we all know, you are out. If you have a yellow icon on it, it's not suitable for all advertisers. Now, you might find that one of your videos is fine, you're quite happy with it, and for some reason it's been deemed unsuitable. You can make an appeal, so you come down here on how to appeal. If you believe your video is suitable for all brands, you can request a manual review. I mean, basically, these all go through an algorithm-style 
uh, review process and yours might have just gone through the net by accident um, and you might have that yellow icon on it, or you might have a strike through and you can actually go ahead and um, basically appeal that and uh, it says underneath here however right now we're only able to review videos with at least a thousand views in the past seven days the reason that is because they've done this um, 10,000 view policy on each channel of course they want to make sure that the advertisers um, are still you know, in, in association with YouTube, they don't want to use advertisers um, or their advertising space on the platform of our videos. So it's, it's just to make sure that we're all playing by the same rules, procedures, policies and all the rest of it. And that YouTube and their advertisers um, are happy, uh, happy with our videos and happy with the content that we're putting out. So, yeah, you need 10,000 videos, not videos, sorry, you need 10,000 views on your channel. 10,000 videos would be a lot, wouldn't it? Um, you need 10,000 views on your video to make sure that uh, you can, you know, basically run ads in the first place. And on top of that, they now have all of these uh, different measures in place. They're just uh, trying to funnel now, you know, squeeze the net and make sure that everybody's going from the same page. Well, I hope you enjoyed that video. I hope it was informative. Uh, if you like it, please give it a thumbs up or leave your comments below. We'd love to hear from you. Please subscribe to my channel and thank you very much and have a great day and bye-bye for now.